I, uh, Charlie Gasparino back with us now on some Marco Rubio developments. What are you hearing, Charlie? Uh, sources are telling the Fox Business Network that Marco Rubio, the presidential candidate, the, the senator from Florida, is personally calling top donors, apologizing for his debate performance. This comes, as you know, the, the debate flub came right before his disappointing loss in New Hampshire. And right now, the, the, the campaign, from what we understand, and we're getting this from sources inside the Rubio campaign, is essentially scrambling to keep the top donors in place following that New Hampshire loss. Now, you know, last night, uh, Rubio, I think, manned up and did the right thing and, and said it was his fault that he lost because he did last Yeah, but he let a lot of precious time pass. Don't you think so? I mean, I know it takes a while to assess that, but if he had seized on that, even a day later, it might have helped, you know? Well, I don't, you know, who's to save 24 hours? I'm just telling you, he lost. Well, have you I ever have, admitted a mistake? I um, think it's best to get it out. Of course, you don't well, make it. Well, he did admit. Well, yeah, but the three days later. Well, after he lost, because it wasn't a mistake uh, yeah. until he lost. Oh, I see. I see. I admire <laughs> the way you are. I admire the way you But what we do know is that he is calling his top donors as we speak right now, uh, just taking taking the blame, trying to keep them in house. Uh, I mean, I think it's fair, pretty fair to say that the, the Rubio campaign, for the first time in a long time, is in what would be described as crisis mode. Uh, they felt. I mean, look at it this way, uh, uh, Neil, and I know this from speaking with people in there. Uh, on Saturday, prior to the debate, they believed they were firmly ahead of Kasich. They were firmly number two. Uh, they might have even, be, based on their own very expensive private polls, you know, breached a 20% level. Donald Trump still winning, but they were on a roll. They okay? were. Okay. Now look, and last night, as you saw in my emails and my tweets, the, 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 the talk inside the Rubio campaign is that they were losing ground rapidly to a surging John Kasich. What changed in that period of time? Well, it was the debate. And uh, right now, these it guys didn't, are in It crisis. didn't help Chris Christie. You know, that's so weird. Well, you know, that's, I think, I think uh, yeah. the Governor Christie, who we were first to report, as you know, is, is uh, according to top donors, is dropping out of the race. I think he comes with, with his own set of baggage, Bridgegate, uh, you know, Northeast Republican, um, just not the type of uh, person in this, in, with this GOP electorate this year yeah. uh, that can pierce that bubble. Um, we'll I still think the guy in the driver's seat is not Donald Trump, it's Ted Cruz. I still think if you really? look at the map, you look at the organization, you look at his intensity on, this, on the campaign trail, and you, you look at you you know, know. where he's He's got a good strong. ground game. But I want to discuss something much, much more important. Right. Uh, you know Pat Cadell, right? I do know Pacado. Wonderful human being. Love him. Have you seen these photos of him with Jimmy Carter, the man he helped elect? And um, he, well, he, uh, let me cut to the chase. He's with him. He helped elect Jimmy Carter. There's Jimmy oh, Carter in the that. Oval Office, and he doesn't even look at you him. You know what you have to do? You have, you to, have ask, to look at the president. Okay, I, I, you have to ask Pat what Jimmy Carter did every Sunday morning and what he asked, what he asked Pat Cadell every Sunday morning. You have to ask him that, and I would prefer, should preferably do that on air. Okay, well, I won't, because I know what we're talking about here, and I value <laughs> this being a family show. But I will say this, I will say this. He elected him, and I begin to think with, when walking away from him, because there's another show we don't have where he's shaking hands, and then walking away, like he couldn't get out of the Oval Office fast enough. And I'm thinking to myself, that's power, right, Charlie? If you can not even be bothered with the most powerful man Well, it is Jimmy Earth, Carter, dude. It's not like he's oh, really? still looking like Reagan or... Well, he was the president of the United States at the time. <laughs> I don't care. Really? Did you live through, you lived through the you 70s? You have issues. I interned Did you live th Carter. I lived through the 70s. I like you lived Jimmy through Carter. the 70s. Yeah, I'm sure he's a nice... Oh, 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 here's the shot. He's a nice the guy. The shaking hand. The yeah, you president know what he's saying, saying that? Please look at me. Please look at me. Please look at me. You know what he's saying? And yeah? he's saying, I elected you and I feel guilty about it. That's yeah, what he's that saying, picture. I can't believe that you're president. Oh, and we have to know, endure four years of this. It's sad. It, I don't it, know. Well, it was hard. Listen, I grew up Who's in the, the 70s. Who's the woman in the background in that shot? Can we take okay. a look at that again? Neil. There's a woman in the background that just says, Neil. wow, he's ignoring you. Neil, yeah, think about yeah. this in the 70s. Yes. Lousy hairstyles, crummy clothes, stagflation, Jimmy Carter. You had a leisure suit, okay. didn't you? Come on. You had a leisure Jimmy suit. Jimmy Carter. And I think he's the worst out of all those, all that, all those negatives. You're a hater. He's no, a good he's man, a nice guy, but man. he was horrible president. Horrible. Uh, uh, bad, horrible. bad timing. He had he a makes Obama a lot of stuff. look like he, he deserves makes, better. He deserves better. He makes the Obama look when I, like times George I've seen him, I always looked at him in the eyes. I even look you in the eyes when I shake hands. Jimmy I don't Carter even like makes doing Obama it. look like George Washington. 
I can't believe you just said that. I'm serious. It just, he, he, he was the worst president. No, 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 no. I could think of a couple of others. All right, well, I just wanted to share that with you, and I want to get your take on it, but you two are... Mildred are, Fillmore. Well, yeah. Fillmore had a little bit of spunk. Is it Mildred, Mildred or Millard? Millard. Millard. <laughs> okay, that ends our, our history segment here. Uh, thank you, buddy. The hey,